right. the email question for tonight, and it's a pretty simple one, Ken. How do you decide whether or not you will take my case, specifically when it comes to personal injury? Yeah, so that's a loaded question. Hmm. Um, <laughs> I saw that uh, before the show started and um, that someone had that question. Mm -hmm. And so that's, that, that it really is a loaded question, but it's, it's really pretty direct and straightforward. Uh, not every claim is a case, okay? So we, as lawyers, we have to evaluate every case individually. It's, it's not like, you know, you, you take every case and mm -hmm. then see what happens. Mm -hmm. um, the law won't allow you to do that. That's not the right thing to do. So what we do is we take every case and we determine whether or not it's legally sufficient. Okay. And you also have to decide whether or not it makes sense for the client to pursue it because sometimes I'll say, look, you don't need me for this. This is something where you should be able to work out yourself. Okay. You can actually get a better result from a net perspective, you know, uh, from a net perspective, yes. in your pocket perspective, uh, if you will work with, for example, an insurance company uh, on something. And then it has to be economically feasible and make sense to the person for us to get involved. And if it, if it does, then we get involved. If it doesn't, we don't get involved. And then it has to be economically feasible to us as a law firm. Absolutely. We have to, you know, we have to look at it and say, hey, yeah. you know, is this a case that we can take that makes sense for our firm, and does it make sense for uh, you as a client? If all those things work, work, yes. then we take your case and we pursue it. And the goal is to get uh, a fair recovery for whatever it is that we're making a claim on behalf of a client. And I think that's a great question, especially leading into tonight's topic about dangerous products. Uh, uh, for more information on that type of question, you can go to deliveringjustice.com or you can go to the WBRC.com and click the Law Call link.